in PV equals NRT, what is R? That is a great question. So let me just define all the different terms in PV equals NRT. So the P stands for pressure. V is volume. N is number of moles. R is what we call um, the gas constant. And T is temperature. So in green, I'm going to write down all the values that are in standard atmospheres or I guess in an ideal ideal situations so ideally pressure is 1 atm Volume will be equal to something we call molar volume, which is 22.4 liters. And I will solve for the gas constant, but I'll just write down its units, which is liters times ATM over mole times Kelvin. And for temperature, I will input 273.15 Kelvin, which is the zero point on a Kelvin scale. And lastly, for a number of moles, it will just be one mole. Okay, so now we're going to solve for R, which is our gas constant. So just rearranging the equation, R equals PV over NT, where pressure is 1 atm, the volume will be 22.4 liters, number of moles will be 1, and the temperature is the zero point on the Kelvin scale. Okay, so solving for R, we end up getting the ideal gas constant, which is equal to 0 0.08205 liters times ATM over mole times Kelvin. Okay, let's see what the junior tutor said. The equation PV equals NRT is the ideal gas equation. This equation relates the pressure, volume, temperature, number of particles in a gas. R here is the universal gas constant. Value of R using the equation depends on the units of the other quantities. So this is true as well. So like it can be equal to 0 0.08, which is what we calculated. Um, also depending on what units you have, it can also be equal to 8.314. So R is equal to PV equals over NT when the pressure, volume, and temperature are expressed expressed in, I think they mean ATM and liters. Well, meters cubed is the same. R is equal to 0 0.08 when the pressure, volume, and temperature are expressed in ATM liters and Kelvin. So the last part makes a little more sense, so I'm just going to say this solution is correct. Okay, so now we are moving on to questions.